Alright guys, uh, I was out here just uh, taking the usual stroll through the woods right here down past my grandma's and uh, lifted this log up and I lifted it from this side right here and I looked toward down this way and I saw a worm but then I saw something else it looked like a snake but I couldn't tell so I looked closer and it was and I'm holding it right now and uh, here it is I don't know what kind of snake it is that's the thing I thought it was a brown snake but it doesn't have any of the distinct uh, features that a round, uh, brown snake would have so it's got a really pointy looking face it's really small uh, it's not venomous I can tell it's not venomous but so I'm gonna take this up to the house get a better look and uh, find out what it is okay so I found out this is the uh, rough earth snake and let me get him out of here a wiggly little thing let's get a closer look at him if he'll uh, maybe he'll, oh, if he'll stop moving if we can get a, get a good look on him oh, come here Maybe he'll be still. Okay. All right. And uh, yeah, this is him. Let's see if we can get a, try to get a good close up of him. Okay. There he is. Not a real distinctive looking snake. Um, usually solid brown. With a sort of a blackish head on him. Here, let me see if. Where is he going? There. He is. But, uh, yeah, he's a real, real cool little snake, and I found him under a decaying uh, log. It's real rotten, and uh, apparently these feed on uh, feed on stuff like uh, I guess like snails and worms and different things. And uh, when I was out there, I was flipping over a lot of logs, and uh, there was a lot of worms under them. So um, that must have been what he was after. But uh, I guess this is the first time I've ever seen one of these because I didn't know what it was. Yeah, that's what it is, is a rough earth snake. It's real cool again. He's doing that burrowing kind of thing like the uh the worm snake did. So you can uh you can tell he's a real secretive sort of snake, you know, he wants to he wants to get down in the earth and get away, you know. He's just sort of trying to take off right now. Yeah. Real cool little thing. This is probably the smallest uh, species we've uh, found so far. And uh, I thought I'd just take a walk down there and see what I could see, and I uh, didn't, didn't think I'd see this little guy. But uh, I saw a worm over there beside him, and I thought he was another worm too, but it wasn't. It was a little snake. So uh, that's what I'm gonna do is uh, take this little guy back and uh, let him go back under his log so and uh, let me get me some pictures first oh, by the way here's the uh, length of him as you can see really really small little guy not big at all so uh, yeah I'm thinking this is a newborn some kind of hatchling or something because it said they uh they're usually born, uh, I think it said around June to October is when they have their babies. So, oh, oops, oops, oops. I need to let you go. Yeah, small little snake. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and let him go.